Hello everyone. Just had to check my mic real quick. Okay, hello everyone. It is me, SCP-682. And if you're watching this, this is going to be about a hard topic. I haven't uploaded for months. Or a month. Something like that. But there's a plague upon us. A horrible, horrible plague has been put uh, put on us American people. And everyone in America or who are in the American states such as Hawaii and Alaska <coughs> are infected. There is only one state that will not be infected, and which that is West Virginia. It will be infected by tomorrow. Uh, you better believe it. This is a serious topic because if anyone has loved ones who are over the age of 60 or have like any me medical di conditions that could that ha that harm them there is a highly like likely chance you should tell them to stay home i just it's hard the american way is gone we, you guys, I just want to say, if we make this, if we make this through, if I make it through alive, and if else does, I just want to tell you, we can't let this happen again. We can't. This is horrible, especially on me. I'm still growing. I'm not fully an adult yet. And this is horrible. My country, I mean, my state is one of the few that to have more than 100 cases of the coronavirus, or which it's now known as COVID-19. We might be in trouble. For those under the age of 60, you guys are lucky, but those in over the age of 60, or I know no one over the age of 60 is watching this, but I know most of you might have a grandma or something. Please, with all your heart, protect them. Please make sure you check up on them every day. And if they're experiencing any of the symptoms, which I don't have the editing power to put up on screen, but if you guys would protect your family members, I just want to say you are doing a great thing for your family. <coughs> I really do hope that people have a speedy recovery if you're one of the people who do have this horrible disease i feel so sorry for you but if you are in fact watching this i'm just gonna say i hope you have a speedy recovery i hope with all my heart you do not die these are horrible times in the america in this in the Americas all across the world it used to be a funny little joke people would talk about but now it's the whole world almost <coughs> yes you may think I have the virus but if I do I'll be okay 
I'll be okay because everybody in my family has had a disease at one point and we fought back. I had the flu, I think, in fourth grade and I felt like I was going to die. When I slept, it gave me the chills. Not only is that a symptom of the flu, I think, but like, it gave me the chills because I didn't know if I was going to wake up. I, I didn't know if my I was going to see my family. I was scared because it was a horrible time for me. The flu is bad. But now there is something even worse which has infected the world. The coronavirus. I don't really want to blame China for this, but it is kind of their fault. But at the same time it isn't. There should have been better health regulations there to check the fish for any viruses or whatever causes disease. <coughs> it's just I'm scared for everybody here on earth. I hope we all live through this horrible time. And I surely hope those who are at my school also live. For in the state I live in, all the schools are shut down. Every school in America is shut down, except I think for the ones in Virginia, but that's not going to last long. So, yeah, this is, this is a horrible, horrible time for our people in America. This is a horrible time. <coughs> <coughs> and you, as you see, this cough is bad, but it's been like this. I just want you guys to know, at any dark tunnel, there's always a light at the end. For every bad situation, there's a good option to take out of it. In everything, there's a way to get out of it. Sometimes it's not the best way though. Life may seem hard, but that's nothing horrible. You should not take your own life, even in times of stress, even in times of need. There is no, there is nothing to do. There is no such thing as an easy way out. Or by an easy way out. I mean by killing someone, killing yourself. That is not an easy way out. That is, in fact, maybe the worst way to go, because, you know, that's a hard topic to talk about, so let's not talk about that. <coughs> I just want to say, I hope everybody here, or who is listening to this right now, has... A wonderful night or day wherever wherever you're watching this or whatever time you're watching this at noon evening morning I really do hope you have the best of luck because right now we need to stop traveling if you're sick please stay in bed if you have a cough, it's nothing you should be feel embarrassed about, but please do cover your coughs. Maybe use your, just make sure your coughs aren't going everywhere because that's most likely 
the way this virus spreads the fa fastest. If you're sick, please stay inside. I've been sick this whole week, or past week, and I have stayed home for more than one day. From the bottom of my heart, guys, I just want you guys to have a safe life. I, want, I care for everybody in the world. Except for those who do bad. But they also need to be cared about. Because right now, we're nearing a time of crisis. By nearing, I mean we're already in. So, my final message is, not for like my life, I will still be alive hopefully. My final message for this video is, always be a good person, always. And during times like this, please, and I beg you, please, use the best hygiene conditions because if you don't you might lose people this virus might be the exclamation point to the human race with all due respect this is SCP-2 signing out and may the force be with you all.